I've been asked to share my healing experience from the trip to Cancun with Dr. Joe just a few weeks ago. I uh, did the advance last year in Santa Fe, had a massive biological upgrade, took me about two months to move through it, and everything in my life changed. I, a new business opportunity showed up, new income, I moved clear across the country, everything in my life has changed. And so this time, I had some very specific issues that I've been dealing with that I thought, well gosh, I may as well apply to be one of the Healy's because I could use some help. So when the application process came out and they sent the email out saying, would you like to be a Healy at the uh, advanced week long? I said, yes, I would. And I filled out the application because I've been suffering with a pretty strong arrhythmia in my heart for the last six or seven years. I have really rapid heartbeats that sometimes really pound in my chest and sometimes I skip heartbeats and I've kind of managed it with supplements and diet and exercise, but it's progressively gotten worse over the years. And then I also have little precancerous things I've been dealing with for the last 10 years because for the last 25 years, I've been swimming in the wild with dolphins and whales, and so I've been exposed to a lot of sun. And so I, those were my two issues that I wanted to have worked on in the session. And so I actually got chosen. I was privileged enough to be one of the Healy's and thank you so much for that opportunity. And so during the week, Dr. Joe had been telling us about, he's starting to see these 12 to 14 foot tall beings that are coming and standing around the room and observing us as we go into these deep states of meditation because obviously we're stirring some things up in the quantum realm. And so he had been talking about that during the week. And so when it came to the first day of the coherence healing, I was in that first group. And the moment I walked into the room, the energy was so strong and so powerful, it almost knocked me over and I started getting really woozy and I actually had to have assistance moving over to my circle to lay down. And the moment my body hit the ground, my body started convulsing and involuntarily, really my arms were flying, my legs were flying, I was coming up off the ground and I couldn't control it. And I knew it was just energy moving through my body from the amount of energy that gets, gets awakened in that room. And as the healers sat down around me, I noticed that two of those beings, those light beings, those tall light beings came and stood behind one of the healers and then came into the circle and knelt at my feet. And one of the beings kind of sat behind the other. It was almost as if it was an apprentice. And the one being came to me and said, remember 15 years ago when you were skiing in Montana and you had that fall and you injured your left shoulder and you've had problems with it ever since? Well, we're gonna start there and work on that. <laughs> and I had not even thought about that, to be honest. I just learned to live with it. And so, the beans started lifting up my shoulder and kind of slamming it back down like that. And it started really hurting. And I said, oh my gosh, that really hurts. And the bean said, don't worry. We have to bring the pain up to the surface so that we can pull it out of your body. And so about 10 more times of doing that in this intense pain, all of a sudden it completely stopped and there was absolutely no pain at all. And then the bean said to me, and now, remember when you were 23 years old and you came home from dance class that time and you had this intense pain and unbeknownst to me at the time, I'd had an ectopic pregnancy and it ruptured on me and I was rushed to the emergency room and I almost died. And the bean went on to say, 
Well, when they did that surgery, they moved your intestines around and they didn't put them back properly. And ever since that time, I've had a lot of digestive issues and problems with elimination. They said, so now we're gonna go in and we're gonna rearrange your intestines so that they lie in the manner into which they're supposed to. And I could actually feel all this movement in my lower abdominal area. And I was just trusting. And at this point, I'm just sobbing because this seems so magical and so incredible. And I feel so blessed to be able to have these experiences happening to me. I'm just sobbing. I'm, I'm, I'm just sobbing. And it's uncontrollable. So they finish with my intestines. And then the bean says, and now, Remember, ever since 9-11, you've been having high anxiety whenever you travel. It's because your central nervous system never recalibrated after that experience. And they reached in, I don't know how else to say this, and I could feel the, like the hand kind of walking along my spine and massaging all the nerves that run along my spine. And then they said, okay, now we're gonna work on your heart. And they, I could feel the hands lift up my uh, back so that my, my chest was arched up in the air like that. And I felt them pull on my heart and massage underneath the heart. And once that was finished, my body kind of laid back on the floor and again I'm just tears are pouring out of me and then they said okay now we're gonna work on your skin and I could feel these hands of light caressing all of the skin of my body and once they were done they bowed and they backed up and then of course Dr. Joe said okay now it's time, I don't even remember the words, but I knew that the healing was over and the healers opened their eyes and began hugging each other. And I was a puddle of tears because something so powerful had happened. And since that time, I have not had one arrhythmia, not one, which was a very common occurrence and my elimination has been absolutely perfect and i've been very relaxed in fact probably a little too relaxed but i know it's a process and i'm allowing my my body to rest and recalibrate from this healing and the other thing that's happened is with my skin i've had all these little i, I don't like precancerous things i'm supposing have come up to the surface and scabbed over and fallen off. So, <laughs> a very amazing, amazing experience. And I've really been in this place of synchronicity and magic and allowing ever since this incredible healing. And so I hope this is really helpful for you and you allow yourself for this healing to just move into you in whatever way it wants to because whether you're the healy or the healer, we're all being healed because we're all in that quantum field. And I also wanna just say thank you, Dr. Joe, because you are changing the world. We collectively are awakening to a new energetic field. And Dr. Joe, I just bow to you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I wish you all a most magnificent journey.